I'm Destiny. I'm Sean. We've been friends for over a decade. And we grew up liking different stuff. And sometimes the same stuff. And now we're watching stuff. Enjoy. Hey there, how's it going guys? Today we're going to be bringing you me, Sean, me, Destiny, watching Yu Yu Hakusho Season 1, Episode 1. This is called Surprise to be Dead. So, now this is an anime I have loved going all the way back since I was a young kid. Um, yeah, it came out in the 90s? It, yeah, it had to have, because I watched it forever. And I was trying to get like so many people to watch it too. And then I got into Dragon Ball Z like later on and all that. But even whenever like I got into high school, I was looking for like Japanese episodes to watch. Oh, you would watch it like straight like yeah subtitles I, or even with no I, subtitles. As a rule, I try to watch shows with uh, the English dub, right? Get the full Funimation bit. And if you look. Christopher Sabat is in this. Christopher Sabat voices Vegeta Piccolo from Dragon Ball Z. He is everywhere in America, and I love listening to that man scream. <laughs> you know, he can he can really he those upper tones. He really can. <laughs> Another person who you're going to hear in this show is uh, the voice actor for Frieza from Dragon Ball Z, oh, and the, the person that they play Frieza is so much so in tune with like that voice that you're just like, oh, that's something like. Uh, you would see a Frieza person do. Oh, came out in 1992, apparently. Yeah, very, very old anime, but very good nonetheless. And so we're going to start it off today with episode one, season one. Yoda Machine! So here we go. Right. So good. <laughs> That's funny. Damn it, when 
Is that old man ever gonna give up? What's wrong? I swear I didn't mean it. Here, take he it. He's... <laughs> Is he known as like a person that like stupid money? Is physically and sexually assaults people? Just physically, mostly. Sexual assault stuff. That is um something that they just kinda of glaze over. Yeah, the girls I think that's just more really like afraid. A, the girls were afraid. <laughs> the girls were terrified. Right? <laughs> Seeing that from this point of view now, but we know it's pretty bad. No good weeds like you shouldn't talk. It makes you sound stupid. <laughs> yeah, he is very physically violent. There's only one person in school who is not scared of your mission. That girl? Besides, Keiko. I mean, like, as a guy. Sorry, old man. <laughs> That's Mr. Takanaka for you. I've been calling for you all morning on the loudspeaker. Didn't hear it. Guess it mustn't be so loud after all, huh? I couldn't help but notice you were leaving us. Yeah? I got kicked out! Is that a fact, my good man? Well, perhaps we should discuss it in my office then. We'll have tea. Hmm. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a toy, old man. Thanks for the visit. Now leave me alone! His mother. Smoking inside. Oh, great. Mother of the year. Get me coffee. I swear, could this day possibly get any stupider? Jurumeshi. <laughs> hey, Kuwabara, you're conscious. I'm not used to that. <laughs> that was a cheap shot last time, and I was only knocked out for a little bit, okay? Now I'm back, and I'm gonna beat your face up so bad even kittens won't look at you. So sorry you caught me on such a bad day. It makes me a real jerk. May I have my ball, please? Listen, kid, that's dangerous. There are cars going by that will splatter you into the pavement. Not gonna leave! Not until he comes out of here and that 
me fight him. He can't do that. I'm gonna beat you down, you bug! You hear me? Who do you think you are, huh? Dirty bug! Who am I gonna fight now? Who am I gonna fight? He's gone! No! You're supposed to be here! Sorry about all that. No! Sad episode. Well, have you decided? Oton, hey. Yes, dear? Have you ever not known about something that seemed obvious to everybody else? That happens to us all, I think. Hmm. So are you ready now? Yeah, I am. Good to hear. Now let's not waste any time and get this baby started. <laughs> After his first day of being dead, Yusuke has agreed to undergo a mysterious ordeal that could win back his life. But what adventures await him? Back his life? The spirit world. He dun, dun, would be dun, resurrected? Dun, dun. Oh, and then everything else that you'll see, uh, usually following uh, that, will be spoilers for the next episode. Oh, okay. okay. And so I usually will try to... Avoid. No, yeah. <laughs> Pretty much, yes. All right, so what did you think about the first episode? Not Where... that I thought it was going to be. I, that was much more, like, sentimental than I thought. I thought it was going to be mostly a beat-em-up kind of anime, but it was uh, a lot more heartstrings. Yeah, this, this, this show's got a lot of heart to it. You saw that just in that first bit with uh, Koenma, or not Koenma, Koibara, Yusuke, you know, you started to see, like, okay, these are two, like, dual, like, guys or whatever, but you just don't know that, like, to Kuwabara, like, sure, to Yusuke, you know, that, that may just be, like, you know, someone he beats up every day, but, like, to Kuwabara, who's lost the 160 somewhat fights to him, like, he's his, like, he's his goal, like, he's his, like, you know, I want to be able to beat him, I want to be able to go over that, and so, now that he's dead, Kuwabara feels cheated. And uh, we got to just see, like, some people actually do care for this, that hard-hearted bastard, you know? Uh, people going to their wake is always, like, an eye-opening thing for the person. Oh, yeah, gosh. I don't ever want to go to my wake. I mean, you won't. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, oh, I don't ever, I'm never put in a situation where I need to fake my own death. And then, like, I have to attend it because, you know, you got to make it look real. Uh. Okay. <laughs> Well, thank you guys again for watching. I hope you guys really enjoyed this. Uh, uh, getting her. Yeah, first on this. episode of the Yu Haka show in the in the bucket. Mm. More to come. I can't wait until we get like some character like love in you. You know, so that, like you can be like, oh, oh. Well, this, did you did you notice any person. characters in the um, in the opening? Because I noticed you said, no, I probably saw a couple of recurring characters. Um, uh, I just really like the vibe of the Botan. Botan. Yeah. I like she's, her vibe. She's, I like her. I like her. The cut of her jeans. She's always just a cheery personality, so I do appreciate her. I love the pink. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you again. Like, subscribe, hit those comments, and uh, see you guys in the next video. Thanks. Thanks.